Winning football's biggest prize is not just about what happens on the pitch, with months of planning going into each team's pre-tournament preparations. Training pitches, medical facilities, accommodation and media access are all key factors when choosing the ideal base from which to launch a bid for World Cup glory. Many teams will face long trips between matches thanks to Brazil's vast size, meaning the choice of base camp location could be more important than ever. Brazil's southern regions will host the majority of squads, with camps clustered around Rio de Janeiro, Sao Paulo and Belo Horizonte. Sao Paulo is the most crowded with 15 teams, including France, staying close to South America's largest city. England, Brazil, Italy and the Netherlands will be based in and around Rio. While only five teams, including Germany, have opted to brave the hotter conditions up north. Host nation Brazil, unsurprisingly, have the best facilities of the bunch, with their newly refurbished training center 40 miles northeast of Rio, the envy of their World Cup rivals. Founded in 1968, its new $7 million facelift was unveiled in March by a delighted CBF president, Jose Marin. The center features everything a modern team needs, including three pitches, a pool and spa, treatment rooms, and even a barber shop. English and Dutch players will have five-star beach views from luxury hotels in downtown Rio, with training facilities just a short bus ride away. How welcome such distractions will prove remains to be seen. Peace and quiet seems to be the key factor behind Uruguay's choice of venue in Minas Gerais, set on a farm amid lakes and mountains. Boredom can also be a factor between games, but Belgian boss Marc Vilmotz believes fishing is the answer. He has ordered his camp's lake to be stocked with trout to give his players the chance to unwind. France have supposedly gone back to basics after their stay in a deluxe hotel in South Africa in 2010 was followed by a disastrous first round exit. But Franck Ribéry and co will still find themselves in five star surroundings in Ribéral Preto with staff going the extra mile to make them feel at home. Two of Brazil's biggest football teams, Cruzeiro and Atletico Mineiro, will host teams in Belo Horizonte, with Argentina one of the squads lucky enough to make use of their world-class facilities. Not content with any of the venues on offer in FIFA's official brochure, the Germans took the unusual step of building their own base on the coast near Salvador, nicknamed Campo Bahia. Germany play all of their group games in the northeast, so as well as cutting travel time, they could also benefit by adapting to the region's warmer climate. Joachim Löw's men will stay in a secure, purpose-built complex that's more like a small village, with 60 rooms in 14 two-storey houses arranged around a central swimming pool. Wherever teams stay, they'll need to find the perfect blend of unity and comfort to reach their full potential on the pitch. But if they get it right, a well-chosen base could be the key to World Cup success.